The summer transfer window has closed, but Manchester United are reportedly still in the market for reinforcement, with Santiago Arias linked with a mob to Trafford. United endured a open form for the summer of Elton Hag era, with the club eventually splashing the cash to bring Casemiro and Antonio to bolster their new manager squad. They also added Christian Eriksen, Tyro Malaysia, and Lisandro Martinez to replace some of the players who left when their contract expired. After the dirty bell started to the campaign, things have sound signs of clinching. A clinking with post tonight Premier League win, probably United, up to 5 in the table. However, it seems United are not entirely content with their work over the summer with additions still being considered. Arias is available as a free agent after saying his contract terminated by Atletico Madrid. So, he can't be signed without a transfer fee. But who, who is he? And why might United be interested in acquiring his service? Her mirror football gives you the lap down. Low down on the midfielder. Arias is 30 years old right back, although he has earned 50 ball caps for Colombia. He has played his trade to Europe since 2011, playing for Sporting Lisbon, PSB in Open, Atletico Madrid, Bayern de Percussion, and Granada. He played three times for Colombia at the 2014 World Cup in Brazil, and this tournament experience come during the most settled times in club football during his career. Santiago Arias, who was born in Medellin, played 172 times for PSP in Hoban between 2013 until 2018, contributing 10 goals and 21 assists during that period. PSP won three LDP title success, which came under the management of Philip Koku. Arias moved to PSP Atletico Madrid in July 2018 for around 11 million pounds, but struggled to hit the same height in Spain. He made 51 appearances for the club, but struggled with injury, including a fractured fibula, and was loaned out twice to Leverkusen M, Granada, after sleeping behind Grand Trifor and Smir Presalco in this Simeone pecking order, he was released December and is still without a club.